Wisconsin vying for the Big Ten championship tonight as they face off against Ohio State. And Leah Linshai joins us from Union South, where Badger fans are crossing their fingers for a last-minute big win to finish off the season. Leah. Exactly, Danica, but from the first touchdown by Ohio State, the crowd here downtown has gotten quieter and quieter. Now 45 points later, the crowd has gotten quite a bit smaller, too, about half of its original size since halftime. And now, as you can tell, pretty much clearing out. But the few, final few who are still here, uh, they're nothing if not loyal. Um, they say, at least since the beginning of the game, they had some high hopes for tonight. In this little corner of the Badger Nation, you'll find a ton of anticipation. Go Wisconsin! Along with a couple of concerns. It'll be really close, I feel. Ohio State is a good football team, but we're a little bit better. For who will become the Big Ten championship title holder tonight? Because I like us more. Does that, does that work? That works, right? Okay. Uh, we're going to win probably by a field goal at the end because our, our kicker's the goat. <laughs> <laughs> but according to these diehard fans, there's no shortage of reasons for why Wisconsin will take that title. We have a better fan base. We have the best running backs uh, in, the, in the nation. Best running backs, best marching band. Best marching band. Let's not forget that. Best marching band. Melvin Gordon. <laughs> yeah. More than just anticipation for the outcome of tonight's game, though, these Badgers are looking forward to what may come after. There will be parties, lots of them. It's going to go crazy. There will be a lot of parties. Will you stop studying and go out? to dip. Now there still are a couple dedicated few still here and one Badger fan tells us he's been a fan for 26 years. He can sit and struggle through three tough hours. So Danica, some support to the very end here downtown. As there always is, Eric Rilo will have much more on the game coming up in sports, but for now, thank you so much, Leah. Well, the